If you want to fully back up the content on your iPad, you will need to connect your iPad to a computer that has iTunes installed. Backing up your iPad to iTunes saves content and preferences such as your home screen arrangement, mail account configurations, network settings, notes, apps, bookmarks, and more. And it makes it easy to restore this content or transfer it to a new iPad. To get started, open iTunes on your computer and connect your iPad to your computer with the USB cord that you use when charging your iPad. One end of this cord features the 30 pin or lightning connector that plugs into the bottom of your iPad. And the other end has a USB plug that will connect to your computer. When you plug in your iPad for the first time, your computer may launch iPhoto if you're working on a Mac. Simply close that and navigate back to iTunes. If you have not connected or synced your iPad before, you will be prompted to set up the device as a new iPad. If you were restoring from backup, you'd choose the second option. Click the Continue button. iTunes will then sync existing music, apps, and other media you have purchased in iTunes or the App Store to your device. Click the Get Started button. iTunes automatically makes a backup copy of your iPad to your computer whenever you connect your device. But you will also notice a Backup Now option. You can navigate back to this page anytime by selecting the name of your iPad in your iTunes left column and choosing the Summary tab. This is also where you can restore content if it has been erased on your iPad. Simply select Restore Backup and you will be given a list of the last times your iPad has been backed up to choose from. After you make a selection, your iPad will be restored with the files and settings from the backup image that you chose. If you simply want to transfer files from your iPad to your computer, you can also do this through iTunes. Select your device from the left column and click on the Apps tab. Below File Sharing from the list on the left, select the app on your device that you want to transfer a file from. Not all apps support file transfer to a computer, so using a cloud storage system like Google Docs or Drive is ideal and requires no physical transferring at all since your files live on the cloud, not on your iPad. One thing you might notice that is missing from this list is your camera app. If you are working on a Mac, the easiest way to get your images and video off your iPad is to open Image Capture after your iPad is connected to your computer. This will bring up a list of all of your files to transfer to your computer. You can choose to import all of your files or simply one. Select the file and its destination and choose Import. If you're working on a PC, simply connect your iPad to your computer and open My Computer. This will bring up a list of all of the devices currently connected to your computer, including your iPad. Choose your iPad and navigate to the DCIM folder where you will find your images and videos to copy and paste to your computer. Knowing how to backup and transfer your iPad files will ensure that your content does not get lost or held captive on your device. Take a moment to create your first backup and then practice transferring an image or video file to your computer.